what is the value of a and b given that you have 1 divided by a plus 1 divided by b equals 1 divided by 11. So from here, let's multiply through by a, b. So we have a, b multiplied by this 1 divided by a plus 1 divided by b equals a, b multiplied by 1 divided by 11. So from here, a b times 1 will give us a b divided by a. a b times 1 we have a b divided by b equals a b times 1 we have a b divided by 11. So from here, this we cancel this. We have only b left. This we divide by this. We only only a left. So we have a b divided by 11. Then let's cross multiply from here. When we cross multiply, this divide by 1. So AB times 1 will give us AB equals this will be 11 times A plus B in parentheses. So from here we have AB equals this times this will give us 11A plus 11 times we give us 11b. Then from here, let's rearrange the expression by taking the whole of this term to this left hand side. So we are going to have ab minus 11a minus 11b. Then let's set it to be equals 0. Then let's regroup this by taking this one with this together. We have ab minus 11b as this then let's have minus 11a so from here let's do some manipulation let's add 121 then minus 121 this will give us zero so it has nothing to this so let's set it to be equal zero so from here we have a b minus 11b in parentheses as this Let's take this man and this together as minus 11a plus 121. Then let's take this to the other side to be 121. So from here, let's factor b from here. We have b outside the bracket. a b divided by b, we have a left minus 11b divided by b, we have 11 left. So let's factor what is common between 11 and 121 is 11. So from here we have minus 11 outside. So minus 11 a divided by minus 11, we have a left. Plus 121 divided by minus 11, we have here to be minus 11. Then equals 121. So mere looking at this expression, we have a minus b in common. So we can factor it out as a minus b. Then after that, a, b multiplied by a minus b in parentheses divided by this. We open the bracket. Here will be b. This also divided by this. We have minus 11 equals 121. So from here, we have a minus 11 multiplied by b minus 11 equals 121 can be simplified. If we are to go with the negative product of this, we have 11 times 11. So we can have it as 11 times 11, or we have it as 121 times 1. Or we have as this, 1 times 121. But if we are to go with negative, we can have it as minus 11 times minus 11. So from here, we can also have it as minus 121 times minus 1, or we have minus 1 times minus 121. This or this we give 121 that we have here. Then let's do it one after the other. Let's say we have case 1. So from here, we have 11 a minus 11 
in parentheses multiplied by b minus 11 in parentheses. Assume it's equal to this. So this implies that we have a minus 11 to be equal the first term will be equals 11. And we also have b minus 11 equals the second term 11. So from here we have a to be equals this 11 plus this. This will change to plus. Here will be, b will be equals this 11 plus this one again. So we have a to be equals 22. From here again, then b equals 22 as well. That's the first solution. Also, if you have to go along with case 2, from here, we are going to have a minus 11. Assuming we are going with this, a minus 11 equals 121. So we have a minus 11 equals 121. And from here, we have a to be equals 121 plus 11. So from here, we have a to be equals 1 plus 1, we give us 2. 1 plus 2, we give us 3. Then here will be 132. Then remember that we also have b minus 11. This equals 1. So from here, we are going to have b to be equals 1 plus 11. So we have b to be equals 12. So from here, this will be equals b will be equals 12. This is another solution. So now let us go for case. Now, in a case of this, it will be the reciprocal of the first one, the solution of this. So, you know, we are going to have A to be equals 12 and B will be equals 32. For this, for this one, so let's also solve for the negative solution and see what will happen. But if you are new here and you find this video interesting, don't forget to share, like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more math tutorial videos. So in the case of having the negative product, so from here, it implies that our a minus 11 equals minus 11. So we have a to be equals minus 11 plus 11. So we have a to be equals 0. From here, we also have b minus 11 to be equals minus 11 as well. So we have b to be equals minus 11 plus 11. Then b will be equals 0. That is another solution. So we are done with this. Let's go along with this. So we are going to have a minus 11 to be equals minus 121. So we are going to have a to be equals minus 121 plus 11. So we have this to be equals a equals minus 120. Sorry, this will be equals minus 110. Now, for this, we have b minus 11 to be equals from here minus 1. So b will be equals minus 1 plus 11. So we have b to be equals 10. So this is another solution. Now, this will be the reciprocal of this. So definitely we have a to be equals 10 and b will be equals minus 110. This is another solution. So if you are new here and find this video interesting, don't forget to share. Bye-bye.